Hello and welcome to the tutorial on Find the Missing Number. In this tutorial we will learn how to find the missing number for numbers up to 70 and we will do this for subtraction questions. Okay so let's have a look at the examples we're going to be working through. For the first one we have 58 minus the missing number equals 20 5. And the second one we have the missing number first. So we've got the missing number minus 34 equals 35. Now we're going to use the same principles we've used in previous tutorials. The first step is to reorder the question. What we're going to do is we're going to, for the first question, this is example A, we're going to swap this box, the missing number, with 25. The objective is to make sure that we have the missing number on one side of the equal sign and the question on the other side. So we've got 58 minus 25. So the missing number is 58 minus 25. Now how are we going to do this? Well in this tutorial we're going to use the vertical format. So let's write this over here. We've got 58 minus 25. The hardest part, or the trickiest part, when you're trying to find the missing number is to make sure you reorder the question correctly. The rest of it is easy. Let's label the columns. We've got units and tens. We are now ready to go ahead and do the subtraction. Always check the sign. Starting on the right hand side, the units column, we've got 8 minus 5. 8 minus 5 is 3. Now we've got the tens column, 5 minus 2, the answer is 3. And therefore, the answer to our question is 33. 58 minus 25 is 33, and we can write this in our original question. 58 minus 33 equals 25. The missing number was 33. Okay, we're now on to the second example. Now have a look at this. We've got the missing number first, minus 34, equals 35. And you know what to do. We're going to take the 34 and move it to the right-hand side. That way, the missing number is on one side of the equal sign, and we've got 35. Don't forget, if we've got minus on one side, when we take it over to the other side, it becomes a plus. So 35 plus 34. Okay, the missing number, the box is on one side, the numbers are on the other side. Now again, we're going to use the vertical format. So let's write this here. We've got 35 plus 34. And notice, we are now adding. We're not subtracting, we are adding. We can label the columns. We've got units and tens. We are now ready to go ahead and do the addition. Starting on the right-hand side, 5 plus 4. 5 plus 4 is 9. Now the tens, we've got 3 plus 3. The answer is 6. So therefore, the missing number is 69. And we can write this in our original question. 69 minus 34 equals 35. Now it really is that simple. Finding the missing number for numbers up to 70 with subtraction questions.